Welcome back trainers. We're going to be taking a look at something that you don't see too often that is going to be a tropius and we're going to have razor leaf on it as well as leaf blade and aerial ace. So this is going to be a fun Pokemon to use. It's going to be a grass and flying type massive resistance to ground because of well it's typings. So we're going to pair it up with Machamp shadow as well as wall range shadow and we're just going to have a little fun here i'm going to include the next battle which is going to be very laggy i was running into a lot of lag today i just want you to see this that uh, you're not just losing battles other people are too because of lag so i don't know it's go battle league and we'll just leave it at that if there's exploits then you know it is what it is hopefully they can fix that but we'll just put it on the lag for now hope everybody's having a fantastic day morning night wherever you're at if you do enjoy my videos give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new turn notifications on and let's see what we have so this this was a very fun battle here up against this galarian stunfisk because it you know we have such a massive resistance to ground we could have just played around there we're just messing with them with such low hp we shielded up the rock side and we're still going so they swap him to their snorlax we bring in our shadow wall rain here i don't know i just the shadow it's great i mean See, what's going to happen with it is you're going to hit a lot harder with Icicle Spear and obviously Earthquake with all your moves. You're doing more damage in general, but you're going to be taking more damage. But the thing about Wall Rain is it just needed that little bit of extra damage to just knock some Pokemon out. So the Shadow is going to be that much better. And then, of course, Machamp is already, you know, established. We don't need to talk about that. Next battle, leading with Machamp, and we will be swapping out the lead for Tropius here in a bit. We have a great lead with the... G Fisk, they're going to be bringing in Tropius. We're going to just throw Cross Chop, see if we can get a shield. Hold on to some of our energy and bring in Wall Rain. That's our best counter right now. Machamp can do okay. Uh, it does still do a decent amount of damage with that Cross Chop, but Rock Side obviously will one shot. Wall Rain is going to do a lot, but we're taking more damage here, so we have to kind of hold it down. And they snuck one through. I do believe we're at two. Uh, we're going to go down here yeah oh man that was that sucks so yeah a lot of puttering today which was really annoying so we're not gonna have that long of a video but hey it is what it is we still got some good battles here machamp taking out the i uh, have spacing out his name talon play <laughs> and here we go this is the battle because uh, here it started puttering here look at this psycho cut gains so much energy if it lags i don't know how much energy they gain there wow and that thing can just farm up quick so bring it in the tropius and I'm like, come on, I'm missing a couple of quick moves here. It's all laggy. In comes the Galarian Stunfisk, and it's not super effective, but it's doing okay damage. We're going to go for the Leaf Blade, of course. And uh, they have no more shields. We've got one left, so technically it's going to take three Rock Slides. So the one here, the shield, and then another one to take us out at the end. So we're going to shield this one up. And I just, I, I mean, I swear I should have won this battle here. Little Putter there, Razor Leaf. Okay, come on now, game. And they are surviving with one HP wow let's go all right moving on to our next opponent folks what are we going to see here leading with machamp all right so this was i think we got another wacky okay it's not this one <laughs> i got something to show you uh i'll let you be the decider on whether or not this is a bot because the movements were uh, not human like all right so let's talk about this battle we had a horrible lead which was uh, very bad because our only counter is wall rain here and surely they would have swapped, but they're staying. So, and giving me both shields. And then we're taking them out after they use that last shield. So what's in the back? It's so weak here. We've got a Galarian Stunfisk. Oh, I think this is the one where Wall Rain does actually sweep here. So we do shield this up because I'm thinking now at the back of my mind, you didn't swap. All right, well, what you got? Okay, Galarian Stunfisk. We'll go Earthquake, one shot it. And we have a Tentacruel in the back. Okay, I guess they didn't want to see the Earthquake on the... Uh, wall range so unfortunately not getting to the earthquake and i do something a little weird here i know this is a showcase for tropius but i go in here with uh machamp i, I don't know what i don't know guys okay i don't know uh <laughs> uh yeah so we're just gonna go ahead and uh just go for a rock slide and i throw a tropius at the very end here yeah yeah got to see some action there so it would have been nice to go up against it just to uh see that razor leaf damage next battle we're met with a talent flame horrible lead it's you know, like we were discussing, you know, it can be okay, but look at the damage that we're taking. And once they start flame charging, you know, it's going to do a lot more. So you got to really time when you throw your charge moves so they don't sneak one through to take you out quicker, right? We'll go ahead and shield this one up here. Uh, let's see. Go for another cross drop. Now, I don't know. I guess we may be able to get to another one. 
but they let it go so at this point i'm thinking all right well just yeah this, what's the point if we shield this up we're going to go down with another incinerate so we're going to bring in wall rain take them out with that shadow powder snow love to see that and a metacham okay that's not great so we're swapping into tropius and ice punch is going to do okay but the tropius eh, it's pretty thick it, it could take a punch it could take an ice punch but uh, we do shield up that first one just to keep us going here because we are grass and flying so it's doing a lot of damage but still taking it quite nicely resisting the fighting and we're going to go ahead and just go for the razor leaf here or a uh, leaf blade getting that last shield because aerial lace does take more damage they're going to take us out here i don't know about this one Let's see uh wall rain's got all this energy okay never mind we're good to go and the next one i think is no that's not the one okay shifter oh my goodness so shadow wall rain this is why it's so good right here if we didn't have it we would not been able to take them out in one shot there i don't think so thank you shadow wall rain next battle met with a swamper this is okay this is not bad shadow swamper versus shadow machamp let's get it so we're doing a ton of damage and they are getting I, I was like, whoa, there's no freaking way. It was a muddy water. I was like, what? How did they get to Hydro Cannon so quick? Are they really charging up for me? <laughs> this game is really busted. But uh, muddy water. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and swap to catch whatever muddy water. I don't know what's going on here. Hydro Cannon. Okay. Still doing a lot to our... Wow. All rain. And they swap into a Bastodon. We get to Earthquake just in the nick of time. Can we land it? Do they let it go? They do. And wow, just one HP. We bring in Machamp to take him out very quickly, and they're bringing in a Hypno to do a lot of confusion damage. We're gonna get off this rock side because it's still gonna do a lot of damage to it. It's a shadow itself. All right, so bringing it down to about 35%, bringing in our Tropius. Now, hopefully, they don't have Ice Punch. Thunder, oh baby, let's go. <laughs> oh, Tropius farming them down and farming down the Swampert, of course. Now, this is the one. You be the judge. Tell me. What is this? What you're about to see. Watch how fast I swap. Instantaneous swap on their end. Watch this. Not even thinking. Like, all right, so bad lead and instant. Like, as soon as I do it. I guess that happens, but uh, that's not my only thing, okay? Don't worry. I'm going to show you something. At the very end, at the very end, I stop tapping. I'm like, hold on. I, I get a hunch. At this point, just watch how they play. They don't shield this up. I shield that up. Usually they kind of mirror the shield, but that's still not enough to say, oh, it's a bot. But you tell me, just watch the gameplay on how they are acting here. It's kind of weird, holding on to shields when they shouldn't. All right, then comes the Registeel. And if this is a person, okay, that's fine. I'm not trying to make, you know, make fun of anybody, but it's just so weird, so weird to me. Uh, anyways, they let it go, which is odd again. We're Shadow, and they hit us with a zap cannon we bring in machamp farm him down now here's where things get weird so they got the um trevenant and i'm thinking us over like, yeah they're gonna beat me because we got tropius in the back razor leaf so they shield up the rock side I'm like okay getting the shield there i'm gonna let this go seed bomb great we're gonna swap so they can't farm anymore bringing in our tropius here to razor leaf them up still doing an okay amount of damage now we gotta call this, we're gonna let it go, Seed Bomb. Okay, nothing out of the ordinary right now, right? No, no not at all. You know, some questionable things, but here we go. I'm gonna slow it down in a few seconds here so you can see. So I just get this hunch. At this point, I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna stop attacking. At this point, we're gonna win and I'm just gonna see. They did not know I was gonna stop attacking. Now, this is the only thing I'm thinking is they thought they were gonna lose, they knew it was over, and so they just stopped attacking. As soon as I tap on the Bichamp, the game's over. What the hell is that? They back out right when I pushed it. I mean, I guess. Seems like a bot to me, folks. I don't think that. Anyways, next battle. <laughs> Whatever, man. Uh, met with a Scrafty. This is good lead. Um, Machamp would love to see it, but uh, we're obviously going to stay right where we're at. Foul play. Doing okay. Tropy is taking it nice. They swap into a Needle Queen. We're just going to go ahead and throw the uh, Razor Leaf to do on some nice damage to that normal Needle Queen while swapping into our Shadow wall rain and immediately getting to an icicle spear which is going to devastate them yeah well i mean it would devastate they don't even have that much health obviously would have taken them out so we'll let this first one go here knowing that the wall ring can survive as a matter of fact i think we're going to shield this up and then farm down that's the play here come out of this with some energy and just about to be ko'd perfect beautiful we're going to hit icicle spear doesn't matter what is going to be thrown into the battle because we just don't have time scrafty and it takes us out exactly so we're going to bring in Champ here Farm up, beautiful, what you got in the back, and a Umbreon, okay, it's rock, paper, scissors here, <laughs> but we're showcasing the, the Tropius and trying to 
scrape together some of the battles that weren't completely puttery and laggy. Next battle, what are we going to see? I think we're leading with Tropius now. Yep, and a Sableye. Yeah, this is where I would want to see it. Uh, Walrein doesn't mind this battle. Machamp, Shadow, mm, doesn't really mind it too much either, but uh, this seems a We'll just see what happens here. Anyways, going for the Leaf Blade here. Now, if I mix up Leaf Blade and Razor Leaf, sometimes, okay, somebody called that one out in my last video. I make mistakes, all right? So we're going to uh, let this go, and I think I want to farm up with Machamp at this point here. So we're just going to go to town. I think we actually shield this up regardless if it's a foul play. They've used the shield, and that's fine. We're coming out of this with energy, and a lot of things are going to have the shield Machamp. Needle Queen, well, that's one that doesn't, of course. So we swap into our Wall Rain, and they're going to Poison Fang, and then swap into something, and we're being lowered on our defense. Oh, they're staying. Beautiful. Going to go for an Icicle Spear here. I remember I very vigorously tapped on that Icicle Spear as fast as I could. Like, no, you're not going anywhere. And then comes a Talon Flame. Ooh, they let it go. Look at that Icicle Spear damage with the Shadow. In comes the Machamp. I tapped on the uh, Cross Chop, unfortunately not getting it off. They're going for a Flame Charge. Now, here we go, folks. This is crazy. Machamp's going to have to pull this one through for us here. So we're getting a shield. Come on, come on. Getting to another Cross Chop. I think we may need one more counter. You know. Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. We take the win. Let's go, Machamp and team. Walrein really did something there. Tropius has put it in the work in the beginning. Holding it down is a nice lead for us. What are we going to... I really wanted to see an Azumarill. I didn't see one all day. Of course, you know. You know. Horribly. What is Skarmory? Now, that's the worst. Swapping into a Walrein. That's the only thing that we can do. Kind of like the uh, Drift Blim. So, this team isn't exactly the best. I understand that. Doesn't matter. Season 11. I don't care. I'm just having fun over here. I... Uh, the goal here is just, I need to double shield this. I need to keep that away from the rest of the team. Uh, but they're going to swap and bring in a Swamper. So I'm registering how I can deal with this. Skarmy doesn't have that much health left. It's going to do a lot of damage to our Tropius. But Champ's going to do okay damage. Maybe I can just go in here and farm up. They're coming with Skarmory. Uh, I can throw cross chops and do some stuff here. So we're going to retreat and bring... Oh, never mind. We screwed our... <laughs> I'm going to try to come out over here with all these calculations and then... Easily just dismissing it by just swapping into a trophy <laughs> with a shield left. Okay, this is not good. Um, just go in for the leaf blade. Yeah, I probably should have went for aerial ace, whatever. Damn, they've got so much energy, but we get this off. And they shield up, but watch what happens because we snuck in a powder snow. They've got like 100 energy. They go down. Oh, that's so bad. And Politoed. So we're going to go ahead and go for Earthquake here, obviously. The champ, we're going to have to swap right now. Oof, that's fine. They're throwing their energy. That's okay. And then we're just going to counter down, take that win. Walrein's still alive and looking good. Man, that Skarmory went down with 100 energy probably. Yeah, I know. Hey, it's part of the game. Got snuck through that powder snow. Oh, next battle met with a Crustle. Not a good lead. Not good at all. Razor Leaf, it's a bug type, so it's not super effective. It's just neutral. It's not even doing that much at that. They hit me with an X scissor, and we're just gonna hold it down. This thing is good. It, ah, man, I should probably use it again. It's just, there's so many other better grass types, unfortunately. Tropius is just a unique typing. Is it really? Let me think here. I guess, uh, it's stats, I guess. It looks cool, fun to use. But um, I think I need to use it again because it's just one of those days where it just didn't get the shine that it should have in potential situations. So we got a Frost Lass over here. Now, I kind of was a fool. I should have went for the rock side. Yeah, it's a lot of damage. Pretty much one shot it. Cross chop still does an okay amount. Should have just went for that bait, but woulda, coulda, shoulda, all that stuff. So we're going to go ahead and go for Earthquake. They got up a barrel in the back, and hey, before you start laughing, it's actually pretty okay. So, I mean, hey, hey, uh, it's like, yeah, it's actually okay. So it's, it's not the craziest thing around, but it's uh, interesting to use for sure. Uh, so we got the wall ring. We're going to town, going for Earthquake here. It looks like it's going to finish off the battle for us. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you need to turn notifications on. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you all next time. Take care.